whole, as Les Brown has had a lot of experience in the industry and training people in, in the industry around the world for many, many years. So Les, but tell me... three decades. Three decades? Wow, yes. that's almost as many years yes. I've been on the planet. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. So, so really, you know, why are you excited about network marketing? As an well, industry? first of all, it was predicted at the time I got in during the 80s that it would be the most secure and effective way that the average person can become engaged in a process to become an entrepreneur, to develop their people skills, their communication skills, and their business skills, and earn some extra money and control their own financial destiny and have the greatest possibility of creating wealth. Now, that was what it was purported to be during the 80s. Now that has proven to be true. Multi-level marketing has produced more millionaires than any other industry in the history of the world, number one. Number two, what they also predicted and, and was backed up by a book written by a guy named Alan Toffler over two decades ago called Future Shock, that, that the, the United States and many other countries will experience what is called a global economy, that the domestic economies, the Iron Curtain, and all of the various types of structures around the world would ultimately be changed dramatically, and people would be in a state of shock. That the 40-40 plan would be gone, where a person can work 40 hours a week for 40 years doing the same thing and expect to retire at 40%, which was enough in the first place. All of those predict predictions have proven to become true. Mm -hmm. And right now, before the end of this decade, over 67% of people who do work will have permanent part-time jobs with no health benefits. So you have multi-level marketing that not only give the person an opportunity to create extra income, but also give people to become an opportunity to become their own boss. And in addition to that, there are many structures that also provide health insurance, health coverage, where many people, millions, don't have that in countries where they don't have social um, health care. So all of the things that were predicted over 30 years ago, those things are now being lived out. It is the best option for a person to give them themselves financial security. Wow. And I totally believe that, so it's why I got involved all those years ago and I've never left the industry. Tell me where you see network, uh, the whole industry of network or multi-level marketing going from this point over the next three decades. You know, you've seen three decades yes. of it already. Yeah. Well, that experience you, in mind. You have to understand when guys like uh, Warren Buffett become involved in Bill Gates and Donald Trump and they're teaching at Harvard University, then we know that it's here for the long haul. And w where I'd see it going is that, that people will see this as the structure that will give them an opportunity to participate in what's called interactive distribution. Because the name of the game is distribution, distribution of goods and services and products. In addition to that, what it also do is help people to develop skill sets that they don't get in high school or in college but real-world skill set that allow them to not only survive, but to prosper in a global economy. As, as things are progressing, Bill Gates said that the retraining of people on the planet, people having to reinvent themselves to become entrepreneurs is going to be the biggest budget in the century. People who still continue to work, they will have what are called the, the triple task, and that is the average person will have to perform three full-time jobs for just one paycheck. So when you begin to look at that, there are people who are going to be coming to this industry who perhaps at one time turned their nose up at it and said, well, I don't want to be a part of that pyramid scheme. Everything is a pyramid. You cannot have an organization, you cannot have a business, you cannot have a government unless it's shaped like a pyramid. And so now those people who turn their nose up at it are now going to be coming here out of the spirit of desperation to control their own financial future. Wow, I love that. And another question, you know my passion for the youth and teens and making a difference to the next generation. You've said it before, I want you to say it again, they're 40% of our population. But 100% of our future. I love that. How do you think network marketing, multi-level marketing can play a role in empowering the next generation? It, it plays a major role. One, it, it teaches them how to organize their time. Two, it teaches them how to begin to develop strategic relationships that add value to their lives. And, and three, it teaches them how to dress for success mm. and how to develop a business mindset that allow them to go into the 21st century, into this global economy, and control their future and not come out with a job mentality and then a mindset of trying to go, go someplace and get a job and hope that they will pay you what you work. 
they never pay you what you're worth. You never get in life what you um, what you want. You get those things in life what you earn, what you produce, what you're able to create. And so now this will help them to become co-creators in their own destiny, in their own future. And I know some young people. In fact, I know one young man who's making over six figures a month just in multi-level marketing. And I mean, he's an amazing young man. Got the vision a long time ago, and I mean, a long time ago, when like he's like ten or eleven, wow. he's now twenty-one and doing ex- extremely well, and he's just a tip of the iceberg. Wow, ladies and gents, I think you couldn't hear it from a better person. Uh, you know, whatever skepticism you might have, whatever thoughts and processes you might have about this industry, I think you'll certainly agree with uh, what Les has just said on this particular interview. You've got to reevaluate everything that you've ever thought about self-employment, getting into business and using a vehicle, choosing a vehicle that really empowers every single person that's ready to be empowered. The question you've got to answer is are you going to stay stuck in a system, as Les says, that leaves you on a 40% paycheck of what you're used to, which wasn't enough in the first place? Or are you going to do something different today to have a better tomorrow? Really.